What's good, Divine Family? Welcome back to my channel, Sacred Healing TV. I'm here to do a reading for you all. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Also, check out my description down below. Let's get right into y'all messages. So, y'all know I get a lot of telepathic messages. Messages through songs. So, it was Gerald Levert. Baby, I'm ready. This person is ready to give you everything that you truly deserve. They don't want to play no more games. Go listen to the lyrics of that song, okay? This person could already be telepathically communicating with you through messages. Look, they're wishing on a star. They're wanting, they're wanting another chance. This person was fronting like they really didn't have feelings for you and they really did. It says endings bring new beginnings. So they are ready for this, <laughs> this love. Look, I need your pure love. This person loved you from the beginning. They did have a lot of issues. I am taking accountability for my actions. Y'all. Remember that short I just did today? About calling them Big Daddy. They want to be your Big Daddy, the Divine Feminine. Look, I wasn't ready. out. I, I owe you an apology. Yeah, you damn right you do. You owe my Divine Feminines an apology. You definitely turn this person on. And they're coming with their heart lighter than a feather. But what they're wanting you to know is, yes, they did have some type of addictions. Um, this was a ladies' man. This man is fine. Okay? But even though he still wanted to play, this person cared for you a lot. And what he didn't realize is that he was playing the same mind games that he would play with these other females. He was doing it with you. No, no, boo boo. That's not how it goes. Okay. They know that you're a sacred. You can't be played with like that. This person is watching you. They could be watching you on social media. What else? But this came out again. They care about you more than you know. They were definitely dealing with some fake divine feminists, some distorted feminists, okay? <sighs> about a pound, baby, about a pound. What I'm getting from this card is this person is realizing it's not about the money. It's not about the fame, fortune. It's, it's really not. It's not. It never was about that. They feel left out because you walked away and decided to focus on you. Period. So let's get some more energy here. Look, y'all close out a cycle. And went right into a new one. It's like you went through this portal. With, it, with everything that you have been through. Your emotions, all that. And walked right into this door. And came out on top. How you feeling right now? You're, feel, you're feeling very successful and very powerful. There are two eights here. So this lets me know, baby, this is good karma. Y'all been having a lot of eights come out. This is your new beginning because you chose you. You chose yourself. There is a spiritual union here. And this, it, this could be this person. It could be this person that is wanting to come in and actually partner up with you and work with you. Because I'm telling you, some deep telepathic messages. Somebody has awakened. They finally woke their ass up. I'm just going to keep it real. They finally woke up. Right. 
the outcome is you've been resting. You've been taking care of yourself, nurturing yourself, focusing on you. And this is what's bringing all of this prosperity in for you and this relationship. Some of y'all may not take this person back, but something's coming in quick. Very quick. Unexpected income. A lot of unexpected income. You've been in this energy for far too long. A feeling lack. You give, you give, you give, you give. And you get nothing back in return. This time, things are changing. It's something that you did. You overcame something. There was a lot of obstacles here, but you overcame it. And this is why you're getting this, this Ten of Pentacles right here. What is this new again for my divine feminine? Baby, whatever this is, Spirit want, it, want you to keep it for yourself. I'm trying to tell you. Keep this to yourself because everybody's not going to be happy for you. Especially people of the past, family, friends. They, they, they're not going to like this. Keep whatever this gift is, this money, this financial gift, keep it to yourself. <sighs> Some of y'all, it's a relationship. Somebody could be gifting you this. It's some type of masculine. Y'all, this came out again. But this time with this card coming out, I'm getting that somebody wants to make something official. They want to grow with you. They want to work with you. I told you they're wishing on a star. But they being in their head. They being in their head. Ever since this has been closed out, now they want to try to rush in. <laughs> I can't make this up. Now they want to try to rush in to bring you some type of justice. But the plan is safe this time. They're playing chess. This person could be a Capricorn. They could be a water sign. They could be a fire sign. This came out again. They finna take some quick action toward you. Yeah, these cards are greasy. And I think it's because it's oil I put on my hand. God damn. Dang, they got a lot to say. Yeah, before, see, they was keeping some things hidden from you. That they weren't stable. They weren't ready for this. This person had to get their money right. Yeah, they was being very deceptive. Very, very sneaky. But somebody got caught up. And ever since they got caught up, all they can think about is you. I just seen 8 8 on the clock. All they can think about is you. What is the spiritual union? All I heard is. <laughs> I keep hearing this song where he says, um, I don't want to play no more. Baby, I'm ready to give you all of my love. Yeah, they're thinking about this. They daydream about you a lot. This is why you're picking up on the energy so much. They could be very emotional at this time. Like, I messed up. I messed up. Because now they see you in a different light. Queen of Pentacles, hello. You doing a thing. Look, they in hermit. This person was being influenced by outside forces. And while they continue to play, you move forward and you're successful now. trying to tell you y'all this person is trying to release a lot of things so that they can come towards you somebody could be homeless they could have lost a lot what's up with my divine yeah I'm not playing this person wants marriage with you they come in to tell you everything everything that happened to them in the past 
everything that's going on in the present. Something about church. You're gonna be happy regardless. You're gonna be happy regardless. Okay? You already moved on towards your new beginning. <laughs> Can't make it up. But this partnership is coming in. Whoever this person is, they're coming in. But they're coming in different. They're trying to manifest you, I'm trying to tell you. Something with these moon cycles. This person's very spiritual as well. They're healing though. They want you to know they're healing. They're working on themselves. They're not gonna come at you any just any type of way. Look, deep, deep regret. That's 11, 11 on the clock. Deep regret. I'm not playing. Look at these cards. I'm gonna show you. Deep regret that they put you in this comp. Oops, this competition. They put the love of their life in competition. Hmm. They was judging you. Somebody could be moving out or they kicking somebody out. All I know is Spirit wants you to enjoy this recognition that you're about to receive. If somebody got put out, You could be having dreams about this person. Or they could be having dreams about you. Someone's going through a spiritual awakening. Or they, they've already gone through this. But they're being reminded about a lot of things. Yeah, this person is ascending. And they coming. I'm not even going to hold you. They coming. Alright, so that's all I have for y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.